Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'll show you how to backup all hardware drivers and later use them again in Windows computer. So, without further more delay, let's begin. So, here I'm gonna show you two methods. So, the first method, we are not going to use any third party software, and the second method, we are gonna use the third party software. So, for the first method, what you need to do is just open the file explorer and now just open the C drive and now just open this windows folder and just scroll down below and just open this system32 folder just scroll down below and now you will see here one folder name as driver store just open this and now open this file repository now here you will see all the hardware drivers folders available here so inside this folder there are some files so these are the hardware files whether it's a bluetooth or the audio drivers or your bluetooth drivers wi-fi drivers display driver whatever hardware drivers are entirely present under this folders so what you can do is you can either copy this file repository and you can just save it in anywhere locations whichever you like so say let me save it in the desktop say let me type a driver backup just to give you an example and just you can just copy it here So finally we have copied in our respective desired locations. So you can now whether either copy it in your respective pen drive or external hard drives also if you want to backup or copy it in your external drives also. So in future you can use all those drivers later on. So I will show you in the later part of this video how to use it again. So this is the first method how you can backup a hardware drivers. So now for the second method what you need to do is just open any web browser and in the google search just search for one application name as driver backup exclamatory so you need to put one exclamatory sign after the backup driver backup and exclamatory just put this and you will see the software official website just click on it and now you will see your download option just click on download wait for a few seconds so the file has been downloaded so let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded and let me close this web browser so just extract this zip file this is often this extracted folder and now you can see here drb key just double left click on it wait for a few seconds it's scanning right now so finally the scanning has been completed now it will show you the enter drivers that are present on your respective windows computer so you can see your enter drivers so now you can either select all the drivers or you can select particular drivers by manually selecting so i will want to back up all the enter drivers right now so what i will do is i'll just click on the start backup now it will show you all the selected drivers and now below you can see where you want to save the driver backup so let me click on this browse and let me select this desktop and let me create a new folder let me write a driver backup and click on let me click on ok you can give a description also about this locations i'll just keep it as it is and now just click on the start backup now it will start to backup your enter drivers of your respective windows computer so wait for a few seconds until the complete backup process is done so finally the backup process has been completed now you can either click on ok or continue i'll just click on ok so our uh, backup process has been completed now you can just close this software and now just open the 
folder where you have extracted now you can see your drivers just open this now you will see here the enter hardware drivers along with the names as you can see here so here you can see the bluetooth even my printer drivers even the disk drive drivers usb drivers display drivers so and so so now the question arises how you can use this backup drivers in the future desk or in later on when we need it again so in order to use this what you can do is if you're using a windows 11 then just move your mouse cursor to the start menu icon and just right click on it and just select this device manager now here say let me click on this bluetooth right so now say i want to update the bluetooth devices right so just right click on it and now you can see here update driver right just click on it and you will see here two options one is searching online automatically for drivers and one is you can search it if it is present offline that is present in your respective drives so let me select this now you can just click on this browse and let me click on this desktop and let me select this driver backup now just open this folder and now let us search for this bluetooth devices as you can see here and just click on OK and now click on next so you can see here the best driver for your device are already being installed so if there is already a newest driver then you don't need to reinstall this all the drivers but if your present driver is older than the backup driver then you can just update or reuse it again so these are the methods how to backup all hardware drivers and later use them again in windows computer very easily so if you never known about these cool tricks then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching